इट इज ऑफ वेरियस टाइप्स आई एम गोइंग टू गिव यू सम नॉलेज ऑफ दैट ऑल्सो बिकॉज कल कहीं जाकर आफ्टर टेकिंग अ कोर्स ऑन राज्य यू शुड नॉट से मुझे इसके बारे में कुछ पता नहीं है इसलिए ये सब थियोरिटिकल नॉलेज हम दे रहे हैं आपको सी मेडिटेशन इज सब्जेक्ट फोकसिंग ऑन एन ऑब्जेक्ट ओके नाउ वेन द मेडिटेशन इज अबाउट नोइंग द सब्जेक्ट द नेचर ऑफ द सब्जेक्ट इट इज कॉल्ड सब्जेक्टिव मेडिटेशन When it is about knowing the nature of the object, it is called objective meditation. Hmm? And when it is just to stabilize the process, the mind, it is called process meditation. So, like this, there are types of meditations. These are the three main main types. Hmm? And based on this, I will be showing you a slide. You must know something about the spiritual heritage of this country. How many types of meditations have been discovered, invented? You know, from right from the Vedic age. Vedic age, when was it? More further back. That's according to your Google. It was actually more than four thousand years back. In fact, if you uh, go by archaeological findings, it is more than eight thousand years back. so indian scholars western scholars are divided on these opinions but i am telling you the vedic age is the most ancient age aur wahan par aap sochiye when the americas were not even discovered europe was under the grip of vikings and all that far beyond before that all this was going on in these himalayan forests jahan par aaj aap baithe ho this was going on in the himalayan forests these discoveries these meditations understanding the the nature of existence and life experiments on all this was going on usi ko hum vedic age kehte hain so the product of that was the upanishads agar aap ek upanishad padhoge you will understand what tremendous research on consciousness was going on so that is what created our knowledge societies of that time baad mein innovation sab baad mein hua lekin initially you see this is your history so this knowledge you will know it best in a sense because it is it is part of this culture lekin aap hi agar kaho nahi iske bare mein kuch pata nahi hai kabhi socha nahi you are losing a huge chunk of precious knowledge i'm telling you you must get knowledge of all the external but you most important is to get knowledge of this system and this mechanism how it works how my thought works how my emotion works how i can handle my vital energies and what I, as a result what can i get because the individual is interacting with the collective with the world remember this isn't it then you will take the right things from the external also whatever impinges on your senses woh sirf aap nahi loge you will choose and take the right things and your life will be very good तो अच्छी तरह समझ लो योग का मकसद ही है टू डेवलप सेल्फ डेवलपमेंट दैट इज द एम ऑफ योग डेवलपमेंट अलॉन्ग ऑल अदर फील्ड इज फॉर द अदर साइंसेस बट सेल्फ डेवलपमेंट इज द स्पेशल फोर्ट ऑफ योग एंड वेदांत तो इसके लिए बहुत सारे टेक्निक्स अब हम टेक्निक्स प्रैक्टिस करेंगे नेक्स्ट क्लास से बिकॉज इट इज अ प्रैक्टिकल नेक्स्ट टू सेशन of uh, on 12th and then later whenever so those are will be sessions when you will actually practice the pratyahar technique adharana technique and dhyan of course samadhi tak hum nahi jayenge no problem don't worry but at least this much you will practice and meditation i told you 5 minute meditation jo youtube par hai iit ka hi hai wo ya yahi pe diya gaya tha you can keep using that technique but i will make you practice it here also a bigger version of that theek hai so with this theoretical knowledge let me move to the next slide lekin hai 